What's up, guys? Riku Shear on here again today, and uh, we got major spoilers this time around. And this is something that I've I've been calling since they put out the dread report and everything, where they were like, "Look, the X are dead, or are they?" But they're dead. <laughs> um, and this actually comes from the UK Nintendo website. Um, I'm going to go ahead and set this to a slower playback speed so everyone can see it. I'm going to mute the video as well. That way we don't get the noise. Um, <laughs> and we're going to get into it. So right about five seconds in, we actually see a hard confirmation of the X parasite um, it's right after this little bit. It's showing off the beams and everything like that. But you'll see it going from this left-hand side, just like, up, well, left-hand side just above me, over, right there. Right there. As you can see, it is right here. Right here. Um, and let's, let's take a, another quick look at that. Let's, let's roll back just a little bit, play it in, and that is... Hard confirmation right now. The X parasites are on planet ZDR. Um, just like I've been saying from the start, there's no way they were not. You can see it moving through the wall over here. Uh, and let's actually move my camera a little bit real quick. That way y'all can really see it moving through the wall. Yeah, let's move me over here. Let's move me over here. Moving me over here sounds like a good idea. Um, so let's go back just a little bit. A um, little bit more. A little bit more. Okay. A little bit more. A little bit more. Yeah, so... A little tracking on this. And this is huge. I know a lot of people have been saying, Oh, those Chozo that we've been seeing are indeed, in fact, you know... Ex-Parasites. Even I was saying it. Um, but a lot of the community was in disbelief. But you can see it move into the wall just like it doesn't they do infusion where they just move fully through it and then in the bottom screen it transforms and starts turning into another enemy so it is hard confirmed now that we do have the x parasites in metroid dread um that makes me super excited because that really really allows a lot of playroom and fun with the story you know just like i was talking about with how fusion ended with Samus losing her weakness to the cold at reconstituting her natural body and everything like that. What I'm thinking is when she runs into this um, warrior Chozo that we've seen, that they end up taking the SAX from her suit. Her suit, not her body, her suit. Let me make that clear. Not her body, her suit. Um, because as we know, the Metroid vaccine eliminates all of the X in her central nervous system, as stated in Metroid Fusion. Um, but it never really fully mentioned that the suit itself didn't have any X on it, especially after the fact. Um, so what I'm thinking is that most likely the suit still had parts of the SAX intermingled with it. And that Chozo takes those part that SAX, or at least a sample of it, from her, which causes her to drop back down to that fusion suit that we know of, or the dread suit in this game, and ends up taking and going in, um, reconstituting her, causes her to pass out. That's why we see all these like flashes of lights with her kind of having like these, uh, I wouldn't say anger or even freak out, but like these weird on looking energies coming off of her when she has like the flashbacks and stuff like that. And it's the SAX is intermingling with her that causes her to do this. Um, so that's one possibility. And that's how they end up making these Chozo warriors, especially in a short time if they weren't already made when she gets to planet ZDR, or they could have been X parasite all along. So there's a lot to go on and it'd be interesting to see. I want to hear what y'all's craziest theories are, um, what your regular theories are. Let me know in the comments down below. I also want to remind y'all that I'm going to be doing a giveaway for both a Samus returns, um, collector's box and a three-pack metroid prime fusion bar 
or not fusion uh gravity varia and phase on suit over on my twitch if we can make it to 750 to 1000 followers we're currently at 605 i think 606 something like that so we got about 100 to go so if you're interested in winning some uh metroid merch feel free to follow me over on twitch as well um if you enjoyed the video of course give it a like subscribe and even if you think I'm crazy, just comment it down below. Much love, everybody. I will see y'all again next time, and keep hunting those Metroids.